This One News update is brought to you by ANZ. We live in your world. A New Zealand river considered among the Western world's dirtiest is finally due to be cleaned up. It'll cost $30 million to start cleaning the Manawatu River, but as Heather Duplessy Allen reports, a sewage plant accused of polluting it has no plans to stop. The river once dubbed the dirtiest in the Western world is about to get a $30 million cleanup, but that isn't stopping a controversial sewage treatment plant from continuing to dump its wastewater in the Manawatu River. It's PR. You put $15 million into cleaning up rivers and you put $100 million into destroying rivers. The sewage plant's drawn public criticism and been the subject of recent court action over accusations it's killing aquatic life. None of the cleanup money's destined for that plant. It will fund the upgrade of six other treatment plants dumping into the river and pay for 200 kilometres of fencing in a bid to stop farm runoff. That'll cost taxpayers $5.2 million. Ratepayers and the dairy industry will pitch in the remaining 25 odd million dollars. The sewage plant will keep spewing treated sewage into the river until Palmerston North City Council's convinced it's polluting the water. What we're doing at the moment is some further investigatory work with the Regional Council to discover whether or not it's uh, providing water discharge quality that's good enough. Now those tests can't be done while the river is running as high as it is right now. This river's been too high all summer long, so the tests may have to wait until next summer. The government denies it's wasting money on a half-hearted clean-up. We wouldn't be putting the money in if we thought there was not the genuine commitment from both the City Council and the Regional Council to resolve those issues. I'm satisfied with that. So taxpayers will pour money into cleaning up the Manawatu River, even as potentially polluting sewage also pours in. Heather Duplessy Allen, One News. This One News update is brought to you by ANZ. We live in your world.